everyone, welcome to Aroma's Kitchen. So today I'm going to show you very vegetarian, vegan and it's like my daughter's favorite. It's a alu palak. So basically spinach, potatoes. Very simple, very quick and it's 100% vegan and it tastes so good. Very simple recipe. So let's start it. Okay, so you need one bunch like a, the grocery store always have like a really good bunch so I have one bunch of spinach I have one whole tomato and one onion so always onion more onion so basically if you wanted to add one more onion it stays always amazing so I use like a nice big large onion and one green chili four potatoes the spices I have a uh, red chili half teaspoon half teaspoon of black pepper half teaspoon of a coriander powder one uh, whole uh, actually two salt two teaspoon salt and a turmeric powder like a one uh, like less than actually one teaspoon so you can add more or I think in spinach you really don't need that much so I think this is good so let's start the procedure peel the potatoes and this is already I washed it so always spinach best part is without cutting wash it first because you don't lose all the, uh, the good stuff so I always first wash then cut so okay let's start it okay so I'm going to peel all the four potatoes Okay, the potatoes are already peeled, you can see, and now I'm going to wash it. This is my vegetable actually washing sink. So this is for my salad, and vegetable washing sink. So we have to add a little bit of water to when we uh, peel the potatoes, wash it, and I always leave the water so it won't get wet. So the potatoes in a, I always use like a warm water. So I add the potatoes. So this is the way I cut because I have a medium size of potatoes, half. And then I don't make it like a too small. So basically this big pieces this big pieces and you can keep the bigger pieces if you like but I like like you know cook everything together so if it's not too big potatoes you can do like maybe a four pieces so basically four pieces is the good size okay so I took the spinach from this bowl because I'm going to use it so I will show you how you can cut the spinach. I use, I cut very very thin because uh, I like it to be blended with potatoes and not to cook really uh, too much. So you can see really not too thick not too thin Okay, so the everything is ready. Potatoes washed, peeled, cut. 
ready spinach cut washed everything ready so this is I have the onions so it's full big onion I like a onion a lot of onion in the spinach I have one whole tomatoes and one chili so chili is always options because we like spicy so not too spicy but a little bit spicy so I use the instead of the red chili I always use a green chili but I in the spinach because spinach has a little bit lot salt so I add less salt so I have the red chili too but if you don't want it but still everything tastes so good when you cook even without the chili but the rest you add it okay so I got the medium pan and because it's a one bunch so if you have two bunch so just take a little bit bigger pan but I have just one bunch and four potatoes with small size so this is good good size of pan so oil so spinach always take a little bit more oil so I use maybe four tablespoon so one two three and four so now I just make it a little bit little bit hot the oil is then I'm going to start adding the first is the onion so so I mentioned that the onion needs to be more so if you find a little bit bigger than this one that will be more good so I use a large like a nice big size so the first onion will go inside and you don't need to make it like a really brown or dark because basically the green spinach will cover everything so just basically a saute a little bit Okay, so you can see the onion is basically a little bit cooked, it's like basically saute. Now I'm going to add the green chili and tomatoes. So now you can see the tomato and onion and the green chili is cooking. Now the time to add the potatoes. I always add the potatoes first because spinach doesn't take that long. To cook so it's easy to cook a little bit potatoes first okay. so I'm going to let it cook for a minute and then I will add the spices okay so I add the potatoes and the onion tomatoes green chili I'm going to cover the pan for just for a minute and turn the heat into a low so the, the potato a little bit cook and then we can add the spinach and the spices. Okay, so I'm going to take the lid off and see. Yeah, so the potato you can see is cooking like a halfway cooked. So now the time to add all the spices. Salt. Salt is always options if you like not too much so you can reduce it chimic powder coriander powder red chili option black pepper okay you can see the color Okay, so you can see all the spices. Now the time to add the spinach. So I always add very little water because spinach have too much water so it doesn't need too much water. Very little. And if you don't want to add a water so you don't have to. So you can see how little. Okay. I'm going to cover the pan at least for two minutes and we'll come and the heat 
needs to go back to medium. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to take the lid off and see. Wow, it's looking really good. And you can see that the spinach are nicely because it's not too like a fine cut, a little bit bigger pieces. So the potato is just still not ready. So I'm going to cover the lid for at least four or five minutes and the heat needs to be low. So now let it cook and then come back and look. Okay, so it's been 10 minutes, so let's open the lid and see if okay, it's done. And you can still see the spinach okay, and see the potatoes, it's ready. I'm going to dish out and taste how the taste is, but it's ready. And this is a very quick recipe and good for vegetarian vegan people. So I'm going to turn the stove off and try with the rice. So the palak halu is ready and I have a steamed white rice. It's always yummy with the rice. I like rice to eat with. But you can eat with the naan bread, roti or prata and um, any like you know um, type of bread. Okay, I'm going to try and see. Mm. It's really good. And you can flavor all the fresh spinach, potatoes. And potato is really well, it's really good cooked, so you can see all the way. So it's good and do try this. Simple and it's vegetarian, vegan and easy to cook and always like you know you can eat with the rice or with the bread. So please do try this and if you cannot come to Aroma, Aroma is on 123rd South, Draper, Utah. 715 East and I'm a chef over there so I can make it for you and you can enjoy it. So please do subscribe my channels for the new video and the new recipes. See you again. Goodbye.